it was on its side, That's and where it's like L shaped like it. this. Uh, yeah, 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 Okay. Like that. Right, Hello guys, welcome to today's Captain's Vlog. It's June 1st, 2018, a beautiful 75 degrees, 75 degrees outside. It's 1219 hours, and we're moving a couple things today. You guys push from here. I'm going to take this side and got it down nice. Don't lift from that. Yep. I can't lift from that. I'm not going to be Which lifting. Which side are you going up? We're going to tilt towards the side. Going up. You're going to tilt towards me. Okay. Um, I'm going to come back. Yeah. Um, walk it. Lift this way. Is the caster overhanging beyond the device? Yes. Don't let it overhang that way. You have to fit it through the door. You are correct. Okay, turn the wheels like this way. Bring the whole thing. Rotate 90. Sure. Okay. We're going to get this other one under there. Maintain a balancing point here. Yeah. Let me, let me sneak in here to the south and underneath this. Are we over? Uh, okay. Box has got to move. We got to swing around this way. Uh, we got to kick this over a little bit more. Right here. Here. Here we go. Let me get some shit out of your way. Need to tuck the caster in the back way up and yep, like that. Come on, this way. This we is can't. a geometry problem. And no, they can't come anymore this way. Nope, we're up against both them. sides. How did they get this in here? Not in one piece. Yeah, they, they did. Had two. It's one piece. Did we have log of it? Can we see it? <laughs> I don't think we do. <laughs> The width of this is fine though. If we move that stuff there, maybe move the stuff out from the wall, push it uh, almost straight, okay. and yeah, then we'll turn it. Well, that even that won't work because when Try it comes it. sideways, you're stuck diagonally on the door. Yeah, because this is too wide. Well, we know for a fact it had to come in this door. There's no way. There's no way the other one. Can't yeah, these doors for a break.
36. Wait a minute. The hood comes off. That's what I said. 37 and a half. So that's still that's like what a, I was talking about like a dozen times. I was like, hey, this thing didn't come in here one piece. Oh, I thought you meant like we divide it up into smaller no, pieces, but you just mean take off the That stuff. one piece might come yeah, off. Yeah, I didn't see the seam up top. All right, look inside it. Inside it. You can't look I inside it. I need a screwdriver. It. Tilt it back into the room. Oh, sure. Hang on a or rotate it a bit. Hang on a rotate it a bit this way. Yes. That this we can time. do easily. There you go. All right. It goes this way. That fits. That fits. This comes off. Yeah, does it come off though? Yeah, take these screws out. Yep. Just those screws. If we do that, we don't have to take top off. Oh. We can take just the deck off. Oh, that would work. Before you do that, wait. We can always do it later, okay. but just wait. Okay, somebody hold this top. You, you need to say that a little bit earlier there. <laughs> okay. If you're ever wondering, that's what navigating with moose is like. <laughs> Turn here! Where? Back there, about two blocks. Yeah. Uh -huh. This will fit now. It's got to go straight go more first. Yeah. Which means Janice we need to move the computers first. Yeah, let's do Push it. it back. back out of here. I'm going to get out of here. Just Join them. See if we can figure out the top, like this piece. And this way a little bit. Daylight. Those aren't the screws you want to take off. Get into here, look on the inside. This rail may extend into there, and if it does, you want to get rid of the whole rail. If you just take out these screws, you just lose this and you still have the rail sticking out. I'd take off these two screws. That's going to just be the light. Yeah, but you want to see up in. Wait. I, if, I'm pretty sure that stops there. Yeah. Yeah. Which side of the motors for this on bottom? Huh? Motors are right behind this plate. Yeah, and, and there side. isn't a whole lot. Maybe on this side. Mm -hmm. There, there isn't a whole lot of motors. It's one little blower. Okay, I thought it was like motor No, motors. no. No, all, all the right. weight is in the the LDF housing that this is made out of. Alright, so we're going to pull up this straight up the stairs, so I'll grab from the bottom, and then whoever wants to grab the top should be okay. that at this point. We pulled off half the way. Okay. Is there anything on the top of the stairs we should get out of the way? No, we, we should reasonably be okay. Okay. Let's do it. Straight up and out. One, two, three. No, hang on. Oh, okay. Hey, Dan, what you doing? 
Uh, going the other way. You don't want to get down there and get a piece of that? Uh, no, I'm fine. Thank you. Okay. Really appreciate you offer that. It's very nice of you. Blow me. Are you guys stuck? No, we're, we're fine. We Tons of rugged men. Okay, if the rugged man can't handle it, I'll have you come down and just make some people your bitch. Do you guys need more help or you got this? Alright, let's try one more time. Okay. One, two, I can't get this by myself three. over here, guys. Steven, get on the bottom. Okay. Are we walking? We're walking. And the good news is, once it's outside, we can pallet jack this bitch. Oh, sure. It, is, it was and continues to be... Uh, what is this for? It's for blowing out computers. This is a dust containment cleaning cabinet. Okay. Oh. Captain to Batman, are you back on site yet, yeah, Batman? What's its fate? Uh, it's going to the computer recycling center. Which is on the other end of the building, and we can't get from this basement to that basement without going out and around. Captain Delary, come in, Larry. Go ahead. I need a pallet jack and an empty pallet brought around to the handicap lot immediately, please. Thank you, sir. All right. Oh, no question. So I got the at the end of this out of the door, set it on, and I will push it the rest of the way out and put the wheels behind it. Uh, okay. You could also. Well, we only have to get it outside and then we're putting it on a pallet, so... We could just pick it up and take it out. It isn't worth the effort to put it on the wheels for this. We're literally going to move it about eight feet. I could always use help. Well, don't... Actually, you're probably okay. Yeah. Yes. Are we ready? Super. Go ahead. Do you need to get the wheels in? No, no we're, we're trying to go outside. Okay. Is it on your foot? No. Back up. <laughs> Back towards the stairs. Back towards the stairs. There we go. Set it up. Where's it exhaust to? Is that like a dust? Uh, it exhausts out the back. Just to wherever. Yeah, it's, there's a big filter on the front. Come on over to the handicap lot. So, uh, Oakley's here? <laughs> right what are they doing today? We're going to launch them? Oh, we're going to build them. I can do that. Okay, do you want Becky and I to get started with uh, them? I have the perfect solution for this. Yes. She's right there. Hi. Hi. Do you have an hour? <laughs> <laughs> they were coming last week, but they canceled because they had a half day, so it all got screwed up. Oh. Shell? If you guys get them set up, get the pieces cut out, get everybody ready, I'll be there in like 10 minutes. All right. Oh, what? Go to that side. Sure. Okay. Down. Good job. Here we are. 
up just a little bit. Okay, down. Come, just come straight on out. You don't, we're, we're going to put it on a pallet. Uh, yeah, putting it on the wheels makes it easier to put it on the pallet. Oh, yeah, okay. just left it push. Once it's up. Sure, push. Up a little higher. There yeah. you go. Down. Woo, All right, good. roll it right on over, and when the pallet jack gets here, we'll take that over to where it goes. Watch it! Oh, good. From my perspective, it looks like it was coming out. All right, guys. Get that, and this is going to be the fun one, into robotics. Yeah. I don't care where it goes in the room. Just put it in the room. We'll figure it out later because robotics gets cleaned out next. But get that into robotics. Get all the pieces back on it. Get it put back together. Okay. I have to go teach kids about rockets. We should finish it about the same time. We're going to do it in here? Yes. Cool. All right. We're doing rockets. Oh, I'll be back. Huh? Oh. Stand it up right we make the turn that way. Maybe. We're going to have to try. Okay. I'm gonna uh, you guys have to move. Okay. You can, you can get out. I can drag it over. And... <laughs> Ready? We just gotta slide it down. Watch back. Okay, don't pick it up anymore. Don't pick it up. We you guys wanna it. turn it? Pivot your end towards you, Joey. We're gonna we're just gonna hit the railing. My hands up against we the railing. We slide it back this way, this back end. Uh slide it this sure. way. No, we just pull. Okay. Now is it wedged? Kind of. What we're going to have to do is your end is going to have to be picked up. Okay. And like up one or two steps, and then we can swing our end back down. Okay. That's one. One more. One more. Ah. You okay? Ah. That's two. Work it up. Steve, it's our spot. I'm fine. Just fucking. Ah, there we go. Now, if you can pull the top away from the wall and okay. pivot it around. Maybe. Uh, I'm catching it this way. Minor trajectory adjustment. Yeah. All right, have I got the rockets? Oh, they're yeah. in there. Cool. I need the first person to bring me a rocket. Come on over here. Thank you, sir. All right. Uh, Stay back. Yup. It's going to go that way as much as I can. Right. I'm going live. Hi, everybody. Uh, Hi, it's KEC Oakley here. Uh, the captain is about to help these kids launch a rocket. Like we've got perfect weather here today for Winds are light and rocket variable. launch with unlimited ceiling. Hey guys, yeah. I'm gonna launch it and it's gonna start out going that way. Then the wind has it and it's anybody's guess. Okay. But the winds are blowing that way, so I set up way over here. Sounds good. Everything's going to work fine. I get to push the button. I never get to push the button. I get to push a button and things all tangle. I did that just for you. I, I, you had one job. One job. Why must it be like this? Hey, I got an idea. We do these things not because they are easy, but because they are hard. We choose to do that which is hard. Go to the moon. Do the other thing. Cool. Well, those are my wires. I'm going to move the engine. So has a question here. Where are we? We are at KEC Oakley Elementary School. Wonderful, sunny, sometimes funny Grand Rapids, Michigan. All right, you guys ready? Yeah! Rocket one away! Catch it! Run!
Run, run, run! Beautiful. All right, I need the next rocket, please. is requesting a countdown on this next one. Countdown? I'm not that good at math. I think we can start at three. <laughs> I'll do my best. I will not only do a countdown, I will teach you a lesson on rocket countdowns. Ooh. Are we going to learn why we say T minus? No, that's easy. That's just T minus. No, I'm going to do a, a little bit more obscure one. I got a question from the audience here. What is in the rocket engines? Uh, solid rocket propellant in this case. We're not using liquid, you know, hydrazine and whatnot with the kids here. <laughs> sure. Okay, everybody ready? Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought they said fire. And that's why in a lot of places, when they do a countdown for various things, you don't hear the number five used. Interesting. Next rocket! And now the audience is asking for an epic malfunction. Uh, the answer to that is hopefully not. Thanks for the awesome question about whether or not we're going to have an Thanks. epic malfunction. Uh, the thing with malfunctions is that they're not planned, so we're not planning on one. There's always hope. There's always hope. So far, the biggest malfunction I've had so far is a really big bug. That's it. Just three? Yep. Oh, I you can launch mine if you want. I will totally launch your rocket. I'm not going to run for it. You got to run for it. Everybody ready? I'm going to try to get this one on slow mo. Are you now? I am. Okay. Three, two, one. Failure to ignite. We got to wait a minute. They wanted a malfunction, we just gave them one. How high in the sky does a rocket go, asked the audience. Depends on the engine used in the rockets. These engines will take us about, what would you say? Uh, igniter field. Um, with these engines, come on, it's not a lot. We're using A86 engines. We had a little problem there, we're fixing it for you. Yes, we have in fact tried turning it off and on again. That is, of course, the first thing we attempt after uh, removing the explodey bits before putting the explodey bits back in. Ah. I'm going to try something. Very pleased I got that one on slow-mo. <laughs> 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 
that is going to make for the best super cut <laughs> of all time. We're just going to give Travis a whole new engine. Yeah. Attempt number three with this particular rocket and new rocket engine. Oh, it's going to launch. Okay, guys, I'm going to need your help. I need everybody to give me a countdown together from five. Four, three, two, one. Shit. Fuck that rocket. We got there eventually. That's right. Who wants bonus rocket? Just now? Yeah. <laughs> All right, this is our last rocket, final rocket. This was a test rocket built by staff at the Galactic Headquarters of the Heat Group. So this is Miss Michelle's rocket. Could someone tie one end of a string to a rocket? And the other to a kid's loose tooth. No, Corey, we will not be doing that. I am totally down with that idea. <laughs> that is that is the best idea I've heard all day. All right. Three, two, one. Michelle's rocking fits right up. Yeah. All right, somebody go grab it. Wonderful. There she is, coming back down for a nice soft landing in the field. Today's coverage was brought to you by United Launch Alliance, and uh, we'd like to thank their team for, for sponsoring this. Their uh, $300 million grant was put to excellent use. Yeah. All right, Joey. 
if it'll fit, well, we have exactly enough. enough. And that is empty. Look at that. And those are empty. And this is mostly empty. So that's that's not bad for a day's work. Is this something? Is this something? Yes. Okay. That is plastic. Yes. Let's try. It. Okay. And these are antenna post mounts for the new antenna post. So it's been a day. There's music and merriment coming from upstairs. Oh, they're having an art show. I'll be back.